Crossbar Ranch is just, I don't even, th even think people know. Like even Lance said, he's been racing here seven years. He's like, today was awesome because I got to see all these places I've never got to see before. Yeah. Um, so it's truly yeah, amazing. I appreciate that very much. You know, it's just, it's home to me. We manage 6,000 acres, 6,500 acres, depending on how you want to look at it. The cool thing about the park is just how diverse it is. And it's it just has that vast wide open field with the creeks and stuff. actually open uh, seven days a week, 24 hours a day, but we close for three weeks in the uh, November time frame, which is the, the weekend before, the weekend of, and the weekend after Thanksgiving because it's rifle season in Oklahoma. So we have a few people that hunt out here, so yeah. we close down and let them do their thing. It's actually a piece of city property. We manage a lease owned by the city of Davis. And the cool thing about it is we have a whole nother attraction right beside us that people are able to go to now, which we couldn't do that before sure. uh, we took over management of it. And, and the city has just been a great partner in getting all this put together. We have a natural water park with a 77 foot waterfall uh, the, the little valley down through there has all types of uh, you know lodging and cabins and things yeah. we're uh, that's our big push right now we, we, we started a contract that we knew was going to be work and the road in was just horrendous and you know so I've spent the last five years trying to get a road in place and now we're looking at putting in new shower houses Championships. This it's will good. be our sixth year in a row with Ultra 4. We really hope that we've got a whole lot bigger things to come and announce with Ultra 4. Yeah. Uh, you know, the, to me, they're family, and um, I think we've built something special together. And I want to grow what I believe the culture of, of Ultra 4 and what the culture of the Hammers is. Yep. So that's that's it's. You know, we, we we're just at the tip of the iceberg on our trail systems and the other land that we have access to, the things we're gonna be able to do up here on this mountain. It's gonna be really, really cool. So I'm, nice. I'm, I'm, I'm super excited. Me too, man, I'm looking forward to it. There was nothing left to say 
That was solid. You can definitely feel it slipping, which is interesting. But um, I mean, yeah, but it just crawls right up it. Once you can dry, I mean, you can feel them just start to dry off and, and get going. You just gotta hit that, you know, what we learned out in Moab, right? You get to that bump and you just gotta kinda, you don't wanna st slow up to it, you kinda wanna hit it. So that was the plan. It just kind of came to be, you know, I, I start, this was a place in my early 30s started coming out here and, and just fell in love with it and wanted to put on an event. And one thing led to another and ended up chasing a contract with the city and took it over and, you know, just been running wild ever since. Had, yeah. I had other businesses, you yeah, know, I had, a, yeah. I had a financial planning practice and a restaurant and, you know, I kind of just gave all that up. and. Dave Cole's addictive, so yes. he, Man. you know, that was kind of where all this came from for me. I, sure. I, I had always wanted to be a part of off-road racing, and I wanted to put on a race out here and got to looking at, at Dave's stuff and thought, well, this is perfect for Ultra 4 too, right? You've got all the rock trails, you got the rock walls, you got plenty of open land for some open, yeah. you know, racing. It's not desert, you can't call it, I can usually right, call right, it open right. desert, but just open trail um, to just, you know, open it up and haul ass, which, such a, it's a great mix of terrain. Feels good. So we've been, they opened up the short course to us here at uh, Crossbar Ranch, so huge thanks to Justin and the whole crew here at Crossbar Ranch. They've been amazing. They cooked some food for us last night. They showed us around some trails, we broke some shit. Uh, and then they opened up the short course, which they usually have closed, um, just to give us some seat time ripping around. Um, and holy cow, it's fun.
if you were having fun? <laughs> I, I was probably grinning ear to ear That's the all entire time. That's all I can tell. <laughs> You'll see him smile all over and over here. Yeah. Huge thank you to you guys always, man. Like, good there's been nothing but uh, amazingness that comes from Tribe 16 ever since we met you guys. And so I super appreciate you guys taking an extra trip to come up here with me and yeah, absolutely. help shake down the car, give me some advice, you know, talk me through all the things that I don't know. We're looking forward to uh, the Ultra 4 Nationals race being out here um, in October. Um, so you guys all make sure you, you check that out. Thank you so much for Absolutely. opening this place up and treating us like kings out here. It's been amazing. Absolutely. We met at Hammers I, I, well, how, five, how long ago? I think it's five years. Yeah. I, think it, I think your first year and my first year were yep. the same. Yeah, the when same we were our first year as a vendor. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and I just, you know, at that time I was going around and just talking to anyone I could to try to spread, yeah. hey, we're doing this out here and I want you to see it and be a part of it. <laughs> well, awesome. Thanks again. Thank you very appreciate much. All I the appreciate you guys yeah. coming out. Thank you.